we made it and the ocean is beautiful so i'm about to dock but i just want to show you guys hello from the ocean today we are kayaking from potoyo village to greenock island so we're already hiked here so this time we're taking the sea route so i'm excited about it so let's get started there is only one minibus to Potoo Village and it starts at Pai Lam. So take the MTR there and exit to the mall that will take you to the minibus station. The minibus 16 runs around every 20 to 30 minutes, so be sure to get there beforehand or you have to take a taxi or wait for the next one. The minibus journey takes around 20 minutes and it drops you off right at the village. The World Ball Center is only a 2 minutes walk in and it's brand new. So we headed on over to their floating center. Once we are changed and ready, we got our kayak and set off towards the Green Egg Island. We are now in the middle of the ocean, which is why I stopped into GoPro. So it's quite wavy today, which is actually not as bad as the last time I went kayaking, but be careful and keep your feelings dry. We are about the third to our boy there. The choppy waves did make one of us seasick, so bring some motion sickness pills if you are susceptible to it. We followed the coastline and made it to the beautiful Greenacre Island. So we have arrived, so we're gonna get lunch and briefing. The water here is beautiful, but the Greenacre Island is crowded, which is why we went up the island across from it. So we're on Lamp High Island, so that's Green Island. So this was more fun guys, the last people. Look at how many people there are. Let me zoom in. Inside. It's like open day right over there. Sad. There is a beautiful small lagoon where we took a dip and there are corals and so many fishes there. We did head over to the Greenick Island next. Now that it's more popular, you see speedboat bringing people here too. So we're now on the Greenick Island, that's the yoke. We're looking for this archway for photos before we have to come back. This is Koto O is about just less than two hours kayaking, depending on how fast you are. So let's see if we're going to find it. We didn't find the arch, but we used the extra time to go snorkeling. The water, though shallow, is teeming with fishes. Getting ready to go back and uh, Chris has a friendly pet crab. The sea is still pretty choppy so it was a bit of an arm battle. We're now in the middle of the ocean. The wave is still really choppy so we all got like extra clothing on because it's getting cold and we are trying to stay a little short so it's like less wavy. Luckily it didn't rain or get choppier and we all made it back to the center. Sorry if I look like a drowned rat, but we just finished changing a duck bag. So just waiting for the minibus. So I hope you enjoy this. Now we're gonna hike more because it's autumn, so stay tuned. Oh god. Oh, <laughs> 